uh, today is Tuesday, June 21st. Uh, yesterday I saw my general surgeon, Dr. Diabalt, and we just kind of went over everything. So got my final pathology back. So we are gonna do chemo first and then plan for surgery afterwards. I was sort of expecting this. Uh, my MRI did show that the tumor was just under two centimeters, but they also saw um, the disease spreading about eight centimeters. So just from my nipple to kind of the top of my breast uh, and the tumor is in the middle. So it's sort of, it's not like I have a whole bunch of little tumors, but it's just little spots that are showing up on the MRI. So whenever it's over two centimeters, I know they usually like to do chemo first. Uh, it's just a safer bet to kind of target everything, kill it, and then go from there. Uh, that way, when they do do surgery, uh, they'll have clear margins afterwards, which means that there won't be any cancer cells in the skin. So if they were to do surgery first, uh, there's a chance that, that cancer could still be in the skin um, so it is just better to kind of get it with chemo first. Everything's happening really, really quickly, which I'm grateful for, but um, I'm not prepared for chemo. So I'm gonna go get my blood work done today. I have an x-ray of my chest tomorrow. I have an ultrasound of my liver tomorrow, and then I'm still waiting for an uh, echo exam to make sure my heart is healthy. Uh, all of this just happening really quickly. I have an appointment at a cancer clinic tomorrow to meet my oncologist, and I guess then we're just gonna go from there and make a plan and pick a date to start chemo. I do think it'll be within the next two weeks. I don't know what I should be doing with my time right now. I, I kind of feel like I'm on this countdown. Uh, only, you know, two weeks of me being healthy and feeling good and having my hair and nails and lashes and things that shouldn't matter but I'm thinking about and it's just hard because I know that um, you know in a couple weeks there's a good chance my hair will start falling out or I won't feel good and I won't be able to have the energy to go out and do things and um, yeah I'm just kind of struggling right now with my free time. <laughs> I feel like I should be getting prepared and I don't even really know what that means.